Hello guys, catman 9654 here, back with a new video, and today I'm going to be showing you how to build this awesome and really efficient mob spawner mob farm. And here's how to use it. Go down the ladder. Wait a second. Okay. Now you walk up here, and this is where you kill the mobs, like that. And you get a lot of experience from this. As you can see, I'm getting a lot of experience really quickly. And then all the drops... They get funneled into this chest right here. Now let's see what materials you need to build it. You need some solid blocks, a slab, five torches, two glass panes, two hoppers, two chests, some ladders, and two water buckets. You're also going to need an area where there's a zombie or skeleton spawner. Spider spawners do not work for this tutorial. Now you're going to want to get out your torches and place torches on every single side of the mob spawner to prevent the mobs from spawning while you're building the farm. I'm also just going to destroy the chest because I don't want it getting in the way of building, so you can destroy the chest. Now I'm just going to place down my materials that I need. Now I'm going to get out the blocks that I'm using and just patch up this little area because I don't want any outside mobs getting inside the farm. Now you're going to want to break all of the walls on the farm, like that, all the little cobble walls, and just make it everything one block wider by breaking all those, just like that. Now I'm just going to patch up this little area again because I don't want any outside mobs getting in and interfering with the building process of it. So now I'm just going to want to dig down three layers. Just like that, as you can see in the time lapse. Okay, so now we're going to want to get out our two water buckets that we are getting, that we have for the building process. But first, we're going to want to break this block right here. That'll be where the zombies fall. Now you're going to want to place the water buckets just like that. I'm also going to want to get out my cobblestone and just place it like that, as you can see in the time lapse. That is because the water flows that way too, so if the zombies spawn, they will just flow the other way. But it's still, the farm's still really efficient, and that doesn't really affect anything at all. Now I'm going to want to dig down 16 blocks, because it'll be a 17 block hole in total where the zombies or skeletons will fall from but i'm only going to need to dig down 16 blocks because i already broke one in the start so just dig down 16 more blocks So now I'm going to need to get out my materials and get the hop two hoppers and the two chests because we need those right now for the collection system. Now I'm just going to go down just like that, break one block, place the hopper down, break blocks like that, like that. This will be a little area where we go to kill the zo zombies or skeletons. So now I'm going to need to break those, break these again, keep breaking. Now I'm going to take out my chest, place them like that. Now I'm going to take out my hopper, crouch, and left click on the chest to have the hopper funneling into the chest. Now I'm going to break these blocks. Break that hopper. Just make sure it's crouching and going into um the chest like that. Make sure that's happening. Now you're also going to need to get out your slabs because we're going to need them for this part. And... We're going to do this, like that, place that like that, there, now we're going to need to get out the slabs, Not like that, place the slab right there, just like that, now we're going to need to take a slab in there, now you can kill the zombies from there, we're also going to need to break those little areas right there, there, now that's where the zombies will fall so you can kill them. So now I'm back at the top of my farm, and this time I'm going to need my glass panes, but first I'm going to need to break these two blocks right here. This is where we're gonna, a little AFK area is. I'm going to need, I'm just taking out my materials, and I'm going to take out the glass panes, just like that. 
Place them right there so the zombies can't get to us, but we can AFK here for the zombies to spawn. So now we're going to need to get out our ladders and dig down right here until we arrive at our collection area. Now that we have our ladders, we can just use those ladders to make an easy way to get up to the AFK area and to the killing area. So now you just do this, place ladders on every single block, just like that. And now you have easy access to the AFK area. Now, if you want the zombies to spawn, all you have to do is AFK at the glass pane area. And then you climb down the ladder and start punching the zombies in the little killing area and all the drops will be funneled into the chest. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Remember to like, subscribe, and comment. And I have a question. Do you guys have any good ideas for any more tutorials? If you do, say so in the comments.